it's not the first time Zion betrayed me under the bus. I don't know the image he's trying to portray to other people. Now me the insult. I defended myself. Why do I have to go and apologize because they insulted me? Yes. But just know that once we leave here, it's over between the both of us. You they threaten me with breakup. Me with breakup. Let's break up. I'm not doing it again. I want to start this video by asking this question. What does it mean when someone says he or she threw me under the bus? Like, what exactly does that simple sentence mean actually? Because Shinwe has been throwing that statement in Big Brother Niger house throughout this season. Whenever there seems to be a little misunderstanding between Shinwe and Zion, the Zingwepe, which are coupled. Whenever there seems to be a little misunderstanding, she will always use that word, Zion threw me under the bus. So, to you watching the show right now, you've seen everything that has been going on. What does it actually mean when Shingwe says, Zion threw me under the bus? Guys, I welcome you to today's video. My name is Shrix, and this is Powerhouse of Positivity. If you have seen my face again, guys, it's because of the drama going inside Big Brother House. We've been going on it back to back to back to back and it's not ending any moment now. So all you have to do not to miss out is to subscribe the video, subscribe to my channel, watch this video till the end, turn on your post notifications so that whenever I drop another video of Boss Boss happening, you'll be the first to do so. After the fight that happened between Chinwe, Onyeka, Chisoba, all the Boss Boss, guys, I told you that Zion was caught up in a dilemma where Zion doesn't know if he should follow his boo, or if he should stay in the midst of his friends and continue with the conversation that we are having. So, Zion as a gentleman chose the best option. So, Zion decided to side with Chin when the whole fight was going on. And at the end of the day, when everywhere was calm, Zion came back, apologized to Chizoba, tried to calm the whole uh, fire, tried to quench the fire from burning and escalating. So, after the whole thing, everything has died down. Uh, Wani X Handy and Onyeka are making up, telling each other, sorry, I it wasn't or it does it wasn't what I meant, blah 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 blah. All sort of uh sorries were flying around in the house. So for Zion, Zion was like, okay, all that is remaining now is for my babe to go and apologize. Because at the end of the day, if you watch the whole was was everything that happened, you will know that Shinwe on any scale you want to rate what happened today, Shinwe is 110% wrong. I don't care what scale you are viewing it for. I don't care from what angle you are viewing it for. She was wrong and everybody in that house knows it. Even the boyfriend knows that Shinwe was wrong. So what did the boyfriend suggest? Shinwe, please, everything has died down. Can you just go and talk it out with this uh, people, can you go talk it out with Chizo? But just say you are sorry. Let's every let everybody move on, guys. That was the only thing Zion said. And she, went, as the boss lady, as the queen, started raining fire and brimstone on Zion. At some point, Zion made a comment that, okay, you show me who you are. Immediately, we are done with this show. The relationship is over. Yo, she went went from zero to one thousand and was giving it back to back to back to like the way this girl talks the way the the kind of reasoning she makes in that house i'm always looking at her i'm like i still don't know what zion sees in her cause that kind of relationship no if that is the personality that she's portraying maybe she's acting maybe but if the way she's been going in that house is her real personality. I pity Zion. I pity Zion because no man wants to come home to that. No man wants to be in a relationship with that kind of personality, with that kind of attitude. Imagine, like, all she was doing today 
with DJ Flo because she's complaining to DJ Flo as I'm making this video right now. She's complaining to DJ Flo, talking about how Zion is always choosing other housemates, how Zion is always siding with other housemates, that Zion doesn't even give her the benefit of the doubt, that Zion doesn't even care what she's feeling, that Zion doesn't care about his feel her feelings. And I'm like, bitch, you are wrong. Someone who you are saying is throwing you under the bus has done everything right to make you look good, has done everything right, has even begged, stooped low to beg on your behalf and came back to you and was like, hey babe, you messed up, this is what you have to do to get on people's good side and you are escalating things, you are pouring more fire, you are pouring more, uh, more fuel into the fire, Why the guy is on the other side trying to blow out the smoke, trying to stop the fire, but you on the other hand, you are busy calling this guy all sort of things to the extent that Chinwe made a comment that she, that that Zion is not even the guy he has she has a mind to come into the show with. Guys, what kind of rubbish will you spew to some extent that you end up exposing yourself? That uh, why 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 would Zion why why would Zion threaten her with break up break up huh? Huh? Does Zion with threaten with break up? Does Zion know how many people she's talking with? And I'm like, wow. So all the five months that you've been in a relationship with this guy, you've always been, you, you've had your side guy that you, you that, 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 that you're keeping at arm, arm's length. So that whenever Zion is out of the uh, out of the book, you just draw that person in. It doesn't make sense. You are sabotaging your relationship, you are sabotaging yourself as a woman. Because you're national TV. Exposing yourself, exposing your dirty laundries, telling us that you can't be faithful. That is what you are doing. And you are trying to feel like the boss chick. You are trying to tell everybody that you, it is about you, it is always going to be about you, that every guy that is dating you, you will always choose you. Babe, it doesn't happen like that. It doesn't. You made a mistake. You are wrong. As a boyfriend, as your husband, as your friend, all I have to do is point it out that, hey, see, you, made, you, you are wrong here. You are wrong. I might defend you in public. I might defend you in public. But inside, I will call you, hey, babe, see, what you did today was wrong. All you have to do is, okay, I'm sorry, I'll go apologize. But no, trying to stamp it that, no, they hurt you, that's why you reacted. No. Everybody in that, even DJ Flo that she's complaining to was like, okay, but let me ask you this question. DJ Flo was like, why you made a statement where you kind of said uh, Zion is not is, is not the guy, or uh, what's this? What's the question again? Kind of I've 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 missed, I, I don't remember, but let me try and paraphrase what uh, DJ Flo was. Uh, DJ Flo was kind of asking her. So you've made a comment where you were like, okay, Zion is not the person that you are planning on coming to Big Brother with. So why did you now choose Zion? And she went on and started, oh, I have my business, I have my oil and uh, gas uh, contract that I'm trying to do with my dad. I have my saloon that I want to open. Big Brother is not even in my books that I've tried Big Brother three times and it doesn't work for me. So when Zion said something about Big Brother while we were having a breakfast, he was like, oh, Big Brother is something I would like to do. And I'm like, okay, since this guy wants to do this thing, let us do it together. And this is what, this is the season. Of partnership let's go in there and I, may, I should have come to this show with my best guys yo it is it is sad when I watch Chingwe try to exonerate herself guys let me know what do you think about this whole or uh, Chingwe talking about breaking up with uh, Zion and uh, Zion also telling her to go apologize do you think that as a boyfriend that Zion should have stuck with her even though she's bad or do you think that Zion did the right thing by telling her to go and apologize? Let me know what your thoughts are down below. And I will see you guys shortly. Because, guys, it is going to be epic. Bye-bye.